Hey, what's up everybody? Brian with you from the Game Cabinet. We are playing some more Crusader Kings 3. We are continuing here with our Grease campaign and yeah, someone pointed out a really good thing here. So we got like 40,000 troops, but right now our quality is only two stars, which is kind of terrible. So, you know, all those troops aren't going to really help us. So we need to get some more knight effectiveness, I suppose, is what we have to do. Let's see. I think also bumping up the size of these guys will help too. Um, I don't know that there's really anything. How can we get more night effectiveness? Probably building some. I just loaded in the game the first time, so everything's always a little laggy. Um, I don't know that there's any military buildings we can actually build right now that give us more night effectiveness. So this is just number of knights, which would help. Yes. Now, there were duchy buildings that were also night effectiveness, right? Yeah. What is our night effectiveness by chance? Uh, where did we see that? 175. I mean, that's fine. It's not terrible. So maybe we do want a military academy then? Also, the reduction in army maintenance seems pretty good too. But yeah, all holdies, all hold, all the holdings in the duchies, this might not be as good as I was saying. This one actually. Does this one upgrade and give night effectiveness? No. What about, um, so if we looked at military academies, Negative 5%, an extra six knights, and 75% effectiveness. That's pretty good. Yeah, I think that's pretty good. Now, why have we built any duchy buildings yet? I don't think we have, right? I'm trying to remember. We did. We built a weapon depot. Ah, because of the levees. I still think that was a good idea here. Yeah, I still think that was a good idea. Can we see the levees per... Holdings? Like, if I looked at the duchy, is there any way to see how much levies we're currently getting from just this? There's no way to actually see this. I wonder, is there any way to actually ever bump up the levy strength? So you're 525, but that's just you. 106, 198. I mean, that's 1,400 levies right there. And that's another thousand. And this gave us how much extra? 20%? Yeah. 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 This was the only levy building I could build though, right? No, we could, yeah, because you can't build another one. Uh, what, what were we doing down here in Cairo? We built, okay, we built the night effectiveness one down here. Okay, all right, all right. So we already got one. That's fine, that's fine. Um, all right, the Duchess. She got married again. Oh, ho, ho. So I can try imprisoning her again. I'm going to say probably not. But we can murder her. Let's do it. <laughs> you cheat on me. I play the long game. I play the long game. Uh, I still don't think I care about any of this. Too many held duchies, you can declare wars. Yeah, 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 yeah. Um, once again, I think we're just gonna chill for a minute. What are our vassals looking at? What's the negative right now? Uh, you're at negative 16, so we'll chill for just a bit more. <laughs> uh, what, how? Oh, okay, I thought he died. So he's full of questions. I do my best to encourage his curiosity, but sometimes I cannot help but get exhausted by the stream of thoughts. Um, I am totally down with curious, though. Although, the unfortunate part means that I have to either give him diplomacy or learning, but we did say eventually we wanted to switch someone to learning, so maybe we go make him learning. Maybe we do. Now, that means we're going to end up losing some of our domain. Yeah. 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 Uh, Duke Thomas presents me with wares from all over the world. Uh, if the religious fervor is stronger, people are more like appreciate this area. Bring food. I kind of almost want to make our fervor weak, but once again, I still am very much about mending the schism here. And anything that gets us a little closer, I think, is worth it. I mean, we're really close. 
Uh, oh, no, we don't need Paragon of Virtue. We need the last one, don't we? Uh, Religious Icon. Which is after Paragon of Virtue. So we still got a ways to go on that. Eh, it's fine. It's fine, it's fine, it's fine. Uh, where are we at? We're over here. New perk. Cool. Yeah, we'll, we'll knock you out. Sell titles, I don't really... Actually, sell titles would be interesting. As we give away titles? Yeah. Count Dusan. Where are you at? He's just a regular count. I mean, I'm not going to declare war on any, like, single province people at this point. I'm just going to uh, hope my vassals do it. So, your heir is still my prisoner. Have no idea how that's going to work out, but I'm down for it. We'll figure it out. He's 70. He should not be alive much longer, just FYI. Um, do we want to declare on him before that? We can't. Okay. We already just declared on him. So... We need... That's it. We need Paragon of Virtue so I can go for Husan. Uh, one life side perk. And we get a county fair. Cool. Congrats. My domain, apparently. Uh, actually, do we want to switch you over now? Yeah, I think we do. Noticing that we can now switch. Um, stewardship and holding taxes. I just... I, it, like, who cares, right? We lo will lo lose plus three stewardship. So we will be over by one. I I think it's worth it. I think it's worth it. I think we want learning. And we want the piety a month. And we want this. Right? Piety per night. That actually is pretty nice. Level devotion. Tyranny gain negative 25%. Don't really want that. <laughs> yeah, just gonna say. Okay, let's do theological focus. Change of plans. Congratulations. Now, we're gonna have too much territory, but that's okay. Our piety gain is gonna go up a little bit. Um, we did build all of, like we built the church in Antioch, right? Yeah, we did, the Grand Cathedral. We don't have the duchy here. You actually aren't building anything here. Um, I'm gonna go ahead and start you holding, and let's do a temple, just because it gives you a piety boost. And I will go ahead and build a... What I really want is I want more of the camel things, but can't do that. Levies are absolutely ridiculous right now, so I don't know if I need more levies. We'll do desert agriculture. Okay. So, yeah, now we have too much. Above the domain limit. You can ask your head of faith for gold. I don't want to. <sighs> now, your piety is also based on his opinion, is it not? From domain, religious focus, religious relations. So, who are we swaying right now? He's pretty happy with us. Let's go sway him a little bit more. I don't know. It might actually only be this guy that gets affected, but here, I'll send you a gift to 150 gold. There you go. There you go. So we're now up to 11.42. That was like 0.2 <laughs> piety per month. Great. Um, we don't care about that. Pilgrimage, 1085. We still got a ways away on that one. There's nothing else that gives us piety, right? Found holy order. Does this give us piety? It costs piety. You become its patron. That may give us some piety, but maybe not. That one costs piety. Uh. That's a lot, man. Yeah, I guess we're just going to keep it going at this point. Scheme discovered. All right, well, that sucks. You're lucky this time, ex-wife. But don't think that you freaking survived. Do not think that you survived. 
Uh, I think we won a couple wars over here. I think we grabbed some more territory. Uh, yeah, right? I think so. Because yeah, I think this just popped. Wait, what? We're now in a war. God dang it, people. Duchy of Mesopotamia. Now, this was in Byzantium. Interesting. Are we gonna do it? We're gonna do it. Yeah, we're gonna do it. I should have waited. I should have waited. Ah, well. Uh, okay. Well, we're gonna go kill you. Uh, who am I fighting here, anyways? The Arabian Empire? Well, parts of the Arabian Empire. So we got a 2v2 going here. This is fine. Uh, we will start coming here and CG. Notable guest arrived. He would make an accomplished commander. All right, let's do it. Recruit to court. 60 gold. Congratulations. I'm always looking for new people. New commanders, man. Lawfully imprisoned Jovanka. God dang it, people. All right, 5%, whatever, get out of here. You can ransom the Duke. Uh, he doesn't hate us. He is friend, family. I'm still gonna say no. You can call in house members. Ah, it shouldn't be a problem. Oh my god, there's too much happening. She got away. Our patriarch passed away. God dang it. I just paid him too. <laughs> we just paid him. Come on. All right, I'll pay you again. And then this guy's going to live a little longer. He's 59, so he should be alive for a while. I feel like the patriarchs live forever, man. Right? Feels that way. Oh my god, stop everything. Thank you. Irene died in our prison. Uh, split, give me the mandrels and a couple of these. And go grab that. Everyone else is gonna go kill. Go kill, please, and more killing, please. I wanna do all the killing, please. So you're sieging that down, yeah. Let's see how well that goes. Now, I did see the, how many troops do these guys have? There's 7K. Uh, hold up. I'm gonna split off a couple more. I mean, keep in mind, we got like 7 billion troops, so not really too concerned. Okay, yeah, you're coming up there. But I did see the 1700. I want to be safe here. Actually, stay there. Go there. Neighboring ruler. Uh, okay, he lost against our duchess in the county claim. Suck it. Nice. Nice. Only one territory, though. One province. Remember when we weren't, like, we are still trying to earn... The cultural head. Yeah, that was annoying. Populous. Stop running from me, you little freaking punk man. Can I get over here quicker? Not really. I am going to catch one of them, it looks like. Okay. 25. We're actually rolling kind of bad. Yeah, our quality is really coming back to bite us, I think. All right, finished the first siege. If we could capture and kill the guy, that would just make life really easy, unfortunately. Easy is just not in the cards for us. Okay, let's go over here. Ah, hold up. I see another 1,700 troops here. Let's go murder. Uh, and then you can come over here. Go split this up. Combatant, siege, faction, ruler. I think we saw all that. Now, obviously, we got those guys we can go kill too, but I'm not worried about that right now. Uh, another person died in my prisons. We love it. Secret exposed. My vassal had an extramarital affair. How dare you? I can't imprison, but that's okay. Trying to catch them. Also trying to make sure that they don't jump on us here. Um, that's exactly what happened here. I am gonna go send you over here. Quality is terrible. Oh, we're good. We're good. We're good. We just, we didn't have a knight, which, and by a knight, well, we don't have knights, but we also didn't have any, uh, uh commanders. Should have put another commander in there. Whatever. Hey, dedication and faith. Okay, so, what we can now do is we can declare war for a kingdom. Good. Good. We're at 50% here. Spouse up to the task. Stunning marshals. 
My steward. How is my steward? Well, actually, here. My marshal's only 39, but he's probably going to die. Probably going to die. He loses opinion of us. Yeah, do Anastasia or whatever her name is. So, are we catching? We are not. Oh my god, can I please just kill you? Ugh, this is getting annoying, man. Your Aquinas, the Acrasis, died in my prison. I don't want to hold a feast. I mean, kind of do, but whatever. Theonopolis is under siege again, you freaking punk. All right, go get down this. We're at 84%. All I have to do is, like, catch this army, and it's, like, GG, I think. Some point. These guys are, like, freaking faster than me. All right, we got to go up there. Yeah, we're going to have to. Although, honestly, if we control this before him, I think we win. Yeah, this should be 100%. They're sending everyone up there. Neighboring ruler won war. Your neighbor has won a war against your vassal. My vassal, you suck. You suck. Okay, Bavaria's pretty big. Okay, there you go. 100%. Let's do this. Enforced demands. I don't even know what... What was the enforced demands? So he paid money to me. And yeah, sure. And we gained the contested title? I don't even know. Someone gained a contested title. Okay, disband all our armies. Let's do this. Victory, victory, decision, found holy order. I still think the answer is no right now. Uh, Shiva, she's just a courtier. We'll do it, just get her out. Don't care about that. Uh, interesting. So I can't declare war on him because he's my prisoner. Now the thing that's very interesting about this You figure he's gotta be having some issues being in prison. Pretty sure he's my vassal. Now, Kingdom of Bavaria, dang it. And you're not my vassal either. I can't declare war because I have him in prison. If I executed him, then this kid becomes heir. Can we kill this one? Like, I'm just wondering at what point does the freaking Byzantium Empire just like break apart? Cause like literally it's just in a bad situation. I imagine his vassals aren't gonna like him too much. They actually don't really mind him. Interesting. Well, he can't declare war on us, but we can never declare war on him. Huh. What if? We converted him. <laughs> nope. You're not gonna pay me 500 gold. Well, you know what? I'm definitely not gonna let you go till you pay me 500 gold. I promise you that. Okay, so we can do your war for your kingdom. And we wanted the kingdom of Persia. Uh, he's at 4,000 troops. Does he have allies? He's also in multiple wars right now. It's gonna cost us 750 piety. I'm down with it. Now, the only thing is our troops are kind of low right now, but this is fine. Okay, so this is going to be a pretty large war. And by large, it's just going to take a minute. So, go here. And then let's start splitting up all of our troops. Please, thank you. Uh, I will go ahead and call on our house members, because they're free. Now, do I want to spend 75 to get her to join in when she has 500 troops? Probably not. Probably not worth it. Justice. Oh, hey, I caught her. Now, these guys might not have any troops, but they're free, so. So, this is all Persia. So, it's going to take a bit, but I wish you could click. Is there a map mode for governments, development, terrain, counties? See, we want a map mode for, like, who they're currently fighting, a diplomacy map menu. Just so we could see, oh, hey, they're at war with that guy, that guy, and that guy. You know, that's nice to know. Okay, mongrels, then levy, 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 levy. We'll send just like you guys for now. This is a barony, right? Yep. 
waiting for the rest of our troops. Uh, your neighbor has won against some random dude. Making sure it's not our vassals. On the scheme of things, it doesn't really matter. Now, here's the other question. If... If he is currently in our dungeon... Can we... Can our vassals declare war on him? Number one. Number two, if I generated a hook, could I use the hook to, like, get territory? I should castrate him. He can't have kids. I'm gonna castrate him. <laughs> ah, okay. So this will make everything feel better, the physician says as she offers uh, the sedane draught. His little hand is shaking and he drinks it all the same. What's the boy is asleep? The physician gives me the long look. Are you sure about this, my lord? Oh god, I'm horrible. <laughs> oh, I gained a lot of stress off that. There's a 5% chance he becomes a eunuch. He leaves the prison. Congratulations, you're free. You can now rule. You can rule the empire, but he is a eunuch, so he can't actually have kids now, which The thing is I'm hoping in like 50 60 years some really strange things are gonna happen With him not being able to have kids You were gonna have to really kind of keep an eye on the succession Honestly, it just oh we stressed him out not us. Oh, that's great <coughs> It's gonna be really hilarious to see what's gonna end up happening to the succession line. I love it. I, I think, I mean, you gotta, right? You gotta try it. You gotta try it at some point. Okay, so let's split off a couple. Boom. Go grab this. I know I'm an absolutely horrible individual, okay? But you would do the same. Don't judge me. There's not a single one of you, given the same offer, wouldn't have done the same. Unless, of course, you knew the succession and how it would have absolutely no issue. You have the county of Barcelona. Interesting. I don't care. Oh, Frankie actually owns it. Uh, you have the Liberty War? Is this via Step Crown Authority? Yep. God, he looks terrible, dude. He looks horrifying. Oh, he's totally gonna lose it, too. Oh, yeah, he's getting his butt kicked. How goes Spain here? Still mostly Muslim. Like, that is a Muslim branch, right? Pretty sure. There is one Catholic in there now. And there's still a little bit of Norse, but most of the Norse got kicked out. Uh, And then we got the Anglo-Saxon up here. So, yeah, it's working. How goes the religion? Mmm, a little bit of Catholic. Scotland, man, really disappointed. They had a good chance there for a while, and then they just, like, got crapped on. Now, Galatia is over there, which is really hilarious. Might re-become Norway again. Anything over here? Volga, Bulgaria is quite large. And you should. I think he has enough to actually become the emperor. Osgil. Too spread out, like too many different kingdom titles in there, so I don't know about you. And then Mongolia has now become a thing. Now... I don't think this is the Horde. He only has 2,000 troops, so I don't think so. Yeah, I don't think so. Oh, that's interesting, their house guard. Uh, and that's probably the kingdom title, not the empire. Yeah, yeah, that, yeah, because the colors, right? I think that's how you tell. Yeah, that's the kingdom Mongolia. I don't know if, if it has to be the emperor to be like the really... God, we're so big, man. That's what she said. Calm down. Why? I don't know. Has lost in the Holy War. Has lost against Count of Fogoya. You're a vassal in the Byzantine Empire. Dang it. <laughs> I just really hope eventually the vassals... I, like, I don't even know. I just kind of hope eventually it kind of all becomes ours. <laughs> uh, we can split up a couple more troops here. And we're going to send you into the water and then go siege there. 
And then let's go split off and start like spreading some troops around here. Uh, actually, go up here. Neighboring ruler against the tyranny. That's fine. I don't really care about the tyranny. Now, 10k troops here is not enough to have full supply. So we'll go there. You're actually fine there. You still have some issues there, but we could take you there and then you're fine. And we should be able to split you here and then there, and I think we're good there. Actually, we could send the other, we could send you here. Yeah, we could do that. Keep it a little closer. Neighboring ruler, one more. We control county of... All right, that one doesn't really help me. Sure. Which war was this? So our dude lost against Duke of Salzburg. Bavaria again. If I could just, man. If I could just take Nikea, I would feel so good. Now the kingdom of Nikea doesn't exist. We gotta keep that in mind. We have three out of the seven. Ugh. I actually thought we had a little bit more. Yeah, I guess it's mostly Byzantium here. Now, can we take this duchy here? That duchy would give us a lot. Uh, we need to claim it on that. She in my court? Neighboring ruler. So no. No. She won't join us either. I don't think we have anyone that has a claim. I thought we were working on it. I don't remember what we left off. We were working on it. Oh, okay. He has a huge army over there. Uh. But I think he's currently fighting someone else. So, I mean, it doesn't matter because this is the war score. So unless he goes and grabs my capital, which seems somewhat unlikely, we're fine. We're totally fine. How far are we on burrs? Hoardings, sorry, seven years. Ugh, I want it, I want it. So they need what, uh, 2,600 troops? Which ironically is not that many troops now, but yeah. So this is a weird point in the game where yeah, yeah. Gain to fame level. We are now the living legend. Maxed out. Good. Faction created against you. You maxed out your freaking uh, prestige. Oh, guess what? Everyone's now creating a faction against you. Uh, okay. Sorry, I forgot to send you. What's going on? You can ransom Shiva. Ah, uh, yeah, whatever. That's fine. You can declare war on the Duke. Neighboring ruler. Um, no. I just don't see the Holy Roman Empire happening. Yeah, I think we're kind of stopping it. <laughs> we have a little too many troops over there. I think is kind of the issue. Oh, we got to keep an eye on you because you're kind of off by yourself. But we saw all his troops. It looks like we're in the north. So where are we? Located in. So I'm actually sieging right now. Yeah, that's fine. Oh, I'm just part of that army. I'm not actually sieging. Uh, no, because we have to grab you first. Oh, hi, I didn't actually notice you before. Yeah, you guys go grab. You go grab that. You guys are staying there, because that's a barony, right? Yeah, that's a barony. Okay, okay, okay. Duke, left prison, left prison. We're going at like uh, mass speed now. Controlled four whole gold for it. Thank you, appreciate it. 22 gold, that one's a little bit better. Neighboring ruler won war against Count. Uh, Transylvania. Okay. And then where was the siege we just won? You. You're actually having supply issues. Which, you know, mountains. Then, not you. You should be able to come here now. There you go. Uh, these are just levies, so it doesn't really matter. If they start maxing out an attrition. So we're gonna have this war here pretty quickly. We're sieging down really nice. Really efficiently, I have to say. So this is not gonna be hard. 
County of Katarn. This sounds like it's in the north. No, it's actually in Germany. Er, uh, really? Hmm. It's fine. Go, 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 go. It's like the one game where you actually can hear the clicks on my keyboard. <laughs> it's the one game in which I have to, like, click a lot. And quickly. I mean, I don't have to click, click quickly, but, you know. Sure. So, oh, this is now the Arabian Empire. BS! Uh, but the nice thing is... We can declare war, a de jure war for Persia. And actually, it's gonna take a lot. Suck it. Ah, secret exposed. My vassal had an extramarital affair. How dare you? Um, speaking of which, can I kill you any easier now? No, 23rd October, 1087. I have to wait 10 years? Come on. Do you not know what she did to me? I feel like you just have too much expectations of me, game. She broke my heart. I need to freaking murder her, man. Chick died in my dungeons. Yeah, yeah, yeah. At some point, I should go through my dungeons. I should. Maybe I'll do that off camera sometime. I don't know. Neighboring ruler won war. This is against Bohemia. I don't think any of our vassals are currently doing much, so. Hold up. Emily's at the store. Oh, never mind. She texted me. Just wanted to make sure that there was nothing like, hey. Do you want this or this? Can imprison criminals. Courtier. Okay, let's do it. I mean, you know what we do now. I am not my dad. She actually has a baby. Who are you? You were fornicating with one of the Dukes, right? Would the Duke get mad for imprisoning someone that... You'll pay me money, so I'll take that. Yeah, you think the Duke would get mad for imprisoning his lover? I feel like he shouldn't. He might, but I feel like he shouldn't. My vassal- Oh my god! What the actual heck happened? My vassal brought forward undeniable evidence that my kinsman, Fosco, was fathered by none other than him. I don't think that matters. The only thing I'm concerned about, I actually got scared there because I thought maybe that was our son. <laughs> I was like, no, don't you do it. Do not sit there and tell me that someone else. Uh, oh, which we can probably imprison someone. Nope, just ransoms. Don't you tell me that my son came from someone else. They definitely need to tone down the extramarital affairs, I think. I mean, I know our kingdom is huge, but they seem to be a little large right now. Uh, neighboring ruler one war. Yeah. And against, I mean, one war doesn't matter. Just FYI. It's only loss war that matters, because one war, we're not going to gain any territory. Loss war, however. Perhaps. And in the scheme of things, it doesn't really matter, because, you know, whatever. Um. You just come back over here. This stuff's gonna be dumb before you get over there. Scandalous priest. Oh my god. So I actually have to do that because we're just trying to get to the next level, man. Now he's mad at us, but, you know. You gained the trait cancer. What? There's a thing inside me which is not me. It eats away at the flesh. Uh, someone's been watching too much alien. Uh, its strength is increasing while I wither away. I push my hands against the growth under my skin. My fingers aching to tear it out. The thought of it growing inside me makes me want to puke now. Okay, well, this sucks. How bad is that? Dude, I, I'm, I'm too young to die. Oh, pause, 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 pause. Yeah, I'm way too freaking young to die, man. Um... Part of me wants diplomacy just to make everyone like us, but I wish we were a genius. Wish we were. Dude, that sucks. Okay, who is the best physician? She's a 14. Actually, you know what? Why are we doing it this way? Look here, find character. Doesn't matter, man or woman. Um, I am gonna do orthodoxy and Greek, so that they're a little likely to like me, a little more likely to like me. 
Duchess. Okay, uh, they can't be a ruler. Right? No. We can revoke her title, though. Interesting. Huh. I don't know what she did. Was she in on that war? And we just never really punished her for it? Perhaps. Uh, so we want ruler, not ruler. Hello. I guess because he's a knight, he can't. And by knight, a Hatara, she's 60. She's 28 and she's really freaking good. She's not in my court though. Maybe we need an unmarried. Do we not need unmarried here? Now she probably hates us. Because we did imprison her. What if... I'm going to recruit you. Oh, yeah, she hates us. Uh, 23 opinion. And we're going to go ahead and try swaying her, too. And then, hi, congratulations, you're my court physician. Okay, cool. A little brighter. So I got reduced disease symptoms for five years. So I'm not going to die. For a little bit. The thing is, we don't mind dying. We got a pretty well, uh, pretty good succession plan. I would like my kid, though. I would like to live for ten years so he comes of age. Just because we would like to finish his training because we got a ridiculously high learning. So I think that is really what we're hoping for. Okay, so this is going to give us the entire kingdom. We're getting 150 devotion. That is nice, and we just got a butt freaking ton of territory. Let's go. So, oh, wrong one. We're almost halfway there. Oh, halfway there. Wow! Tiles can be usurped. Might as well just do them. Might as well just do them. Uh, Head of Faith, no, create the Kingdom of Persia. Yes, thank you. If you hit Thari, uh, that should fix itself. This is just, yeah, the random dude I don't care about. Um, low control in counties, disabled building, efficient, let's see, the Friday Mosque. Holding taxes, development growth. Huh, interesting. Well, yeah, we don't care about that. Prisoners can be ransomed. Uh, don't care about that. Designate guardian. We are actually, you don't have a guardian yet, that was, okay, there you go. <laughs> yeah, we want, we want to be his guardian, because we are awesome at learning. And then, yeah, we have five duchies technically right now, which we're gonna work on. Okay, so now that we have the Kingdom of Persia, we can actually de jure here. It's only one territory. This is not part of Persia right there? Really? That is not part of Persia right there. Well, that's unfortunate. Meh. Hold feast, call hunt. Ugh. So now we get the exact fun stuff of like splitting territory up. Yeah. It's the problem with war is it's like, okay, we gotta keep finding people. Okay, so um, I don't care about mail. Ma uh, uh, we need mail. All on that, not a ruler, yeah. Orthodoxy Greek, this is what we wanna see. So then give me someone with high stewardship. Gabriel, congratulations. You are now going to get like boom and Let's see where that is. I did create all the duchies already. So doom, doom and give me the duchy. Boom. Thank you. So then we have these two territories here. And let's get someone that's kind of crap. I don't really care. Uh, let's do someone with low marshal. The reason for that is if they're a knight, then I don't care about losing them. Get you. It's C, Brian. Just hit C. Just hit C. And we want this low, please. And also remember, look for people that uh, don't have claims, please. 
Above that's the limit. Uh, yeah, you know, we're working on that. Congrat, vassals. We might have to give this kingdom away. Yeah. We might. Okay, so we're still good here. Also, I'm gonna save real quick before we keep giving away more territory and then accidentally screw ourselves over. We gotta wrap this episode up as well, but... I hate how much territory she has in, like, random places, but it is what it is. Okay, so then... Let us find character. Let's see. Give me... a uh, Pause. 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 My alien wife. Hey, you know what? Do what you want. If you kill her, I don't really care. To be straight up honest, I actually don't care. I already got my son. So, you do you. I trust you. I probably shouldn't, but whatever. All right, so you're 21. Decent. Um, let's look here. There's a lot of territories. This seems like there's multiple duchies here. I feel like this duchy has really that many territories in there. All right, well, I'll give him four and then the duchy. Yeah, and then I'll give two and two. I think. Once again, I didn't look to see whether or not he had titles. Uh, I know I'm above my vassal limit, uh, but we should not because, yeah, no, we should be right at 60. Yeah. Okay, who else do we have here? You're just some random dude. We might actually have family members now. I probably could be giving stuff away too, but it's too late. And then, boom, congratulations, boom, congratulations. Okay. So we're fine now. You're in line to inherit titles. Prisoners can be ransomed. Irene. Um, you're married, so I'm not going to worry about it. Yeah. So I think we're good to go now. Um, I hate that that's the Arabian Empire, because now, like, to take this... Uh, it's just annoying. What duchy is that? She still has so many freaking duchies. That's annoying. Oh, that's only like one territory too. <sighs> I might declare war for that one, just cause it then gives us options of you and you. We are getting close to India though, guys. We are not far away. That feels nice. That feels nice. Are we getting any additional things here because of... That's Iberia, Arabia. We have one. So no, not quite. And, I mean, here's the thing. I can't imagine war elephants are going to be worth much for us at this point. Like, I would imagine the war elephants have to be... I mean, that's a lot of freaking damage. I take that back. But they're only good in jungle. Well, they get a bonus in jungle. They're mediocre for everything else. We could almost do war camels. I don't think they're better, though, than our horsies. They're probably just better in deserts, but, like, we're not really planning on fighting in the desert. So, yeah. Dude, we're getting close to, like, Alexander's Empire here. And it probably looks very similar to Alexander's Empire, where there was just, like, a whole lot of, like, nothing in the middle. But, you know, hope you guys enjoyed the episode. If you did, drop a like, comment, let me know what you think. As always, hit the subscribe button, join the game, come, and share your support. I'll see you guys later. Bye, everybody!